It is December 25th. Merry Christmas to all who celebrate and best wishes to all who don't. Uh, let's play Redactyl number 628 while the roast potatoes are in the oven. So I won't spend too long on this. We have an eight-letter word. Difficulty seems to be low. In 11, 6, and 10, 8 is the 7, 9. From the 4 of a 6, 8. The 8 is something as the something is also known. Maybe something as the whatever. 8 is a 7 of 10, meaning it is a 7 of something is blank out from other something something. It is the something of a 12 and the 10 of the something with 6. And it is often maybe something by 1 to the power of something 5 to the power of something. And then we have some other little powers and then we have three with one in parentheses. Okay, so I'm thinking something mathematically with the powers. And nine of eight as a seven of ten is that it is more something than or less. For example, the eight of a something. Uh, I'm wondering if it's something like a, an inverse or not that, because that's only seven. There are, there are something. Yeah, not um, immediately. Here's the etymology. The word eight was first introduced by 6-6 six, six in his some year paper. The interaction between 9 on the 11 of 9-11, and then this looks like a quote from his or her book. Yeah, this could be uh, tricky. Okay, we have a sigma from, I suppose, zero or one to something. That is... Hmm. And then, uh, is that calculus there? That little fancy guy. Is it going from zero? Yeah, from zero to infinity, the limit. Is that what you call that? Um, yeah, I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time on this, but um, in... What is this? 11.6. Um, well, let's try mathematics is 11. Wow, there isn't a single mention of mathematics. How about calculus? Not a single mention of calculus. So maybe they're using mathematics, but it's not itself a mathematical topic. That confuses me. Well, let's try number something basic. If an infinite number of monkeys... Oh, I mistyped it there. Let's try it. There we go. If an infinite number of 12 or something... Uh, not calculated, but let's try that. Okay, there are 11. If a number of something or something using a something... Then the something something calculated from that infinite sum. No infinite set. 
Oh, I hate when it's set theory. Oh, a set of, well, let's try numbers, plural. Yeah, is something out from other? No, out from. It is a something is blank out from. Eight is a, um, not property, but let's try that. Three properties. The uh, something property. Um, let's try limit. Just a single limit, which is used in the something limit something. Well, let's try a series that sometimes comes up. No, not a single series. Uh, well, we got a lot of, well, we got seven set, so let's try sets. Just two of those. Um, let's try rational. Oops. Irrational. No. Um, let's try mathematician. Not a single mathematician. How about physics? One physics. This something correspondence relationship between members. No, between something. Along a line? Ooh, okay. Um, just two lines. How about a circle? No. Okay, this is going to be a very... I was really hoping for a quick one so I can get back to Christmas, but... Um, and by the way, this is going to be my last uh, redactal for this year. Um, and so I will be back sometime in the new year, I hope. Let's see. Let's do some common words. Any, all, some, most, more, um, many. Eight is the seven. Uh, how about factorial? No. From the form of A, from the... No. All right, I think rather than struggle with this one, I am going to use some hints. Okay, well, let's get this area. Ah, statistics, okay. Uh, deviation is nine. Oh, okay. Standard is eight, is the uh, normal, is the something deviation from the norm? No, or from the in, um, probability. Uh -huh. in probability six. What's that six in probability? Something in statistics eight is the blank deviation from the from the mean, of course. Yeah, the mean of a Sample. Ooh, a lot of samples. Okay, I'm going to use another hint to see what type of deviation. Squared deviation. What would, if I was a mathematician and I came up with this squared deviation, what would I call it? Squeeviation, I think I would say. Um... No, I'm, 
have a bad feeling about this uh, from the mean of a 6, 8. Let me get one of those words. Um, let's go with 8. Oh, I'll be fair of something of a blank variable. What kind of variable? Known. Um, Is, is something is also is also often often blank as the blank of the stand oh well the square I suppose square of the standard deviation no I've yeah I don't think I know this so I am going to give up yes Variance. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I mean, I always assumed it had just a very general meaning, but it seems to be very specific. Measure of how far a set of numbers is spread out from their average value. Uh, distribution. Yeah, I, I'm not familiar with any of this stuff. Well, let me see if I can uh, find yesterday's puzzle, since I was uh, very busy yesterday having fun, uh, and then see if I can f track that down. All right, here is 627. What I missed yesterday, difficulty seems to be medium. Long word, 11, is one of the three major, no, four major along with something something and something all right i think i'm going to try something a little different just um, start typing words as quickly as possible and see where that takes me science art history um what could it be what should i along with um well, it didn't have science. Let's try physics. No, let's look at our two arts. Something art and something art. Uh, plastic is only seven. Visual. Language. In other. Their language. People. To the native people, to the uh, French people, to the German people, to the Irish people, just two people among the, among the something people. Uh, let's try Asia, on Asia. Uh, let's try Africa. Uh, Europe, America, North America, South America. Um, what is six? I wonder. Um, huh, not sure what that could be. Let's try early. In the early something history, oh, I did history, didn't I? Um, let's try first as the largest. No, and first, second for the second blank of something. Oh, let's try war. Just a single war. There's something of a war between four and four. Hmm. Peru? No. All right. Um, last Christmas. Last seen. Last used. Oh, used is not redacted, of course. 
All right, is it? Oh, hold on, there was something interesting there. Was that? Uh, ah, I thought it was a comma, but it's uh, six followed by another character according to the economist. No, according, oh, it's the nine, the uh, Washington, no, the uh, something, something. There are 26, 21 flavors, 22, 22 blank of something. Yeah, there we have five. One is it A, B, X, Y, Z. Oh, we did have a Y. Ooh, the letter Y. The letter something, or two or more. Letter H, in which the two. So I think this might be about the shape of something. All right, what could this be? Um, let's try human. No human. Let's try male, female. There's a female and something female, something. According to Hoyle, there is evidence of early oh, could it be something to do with archaeology no how about civilization no um, how about a home work does something work is that somebody with a leading Initial. There's a lot of according to history. Uh, let's look for century. 20th, 19th, 18th, 17th, 16th. Oh my goodness. Yeah, finally, but um, looks like we've got a lot of centuries. 11 is one of the uh, three. Well, I thought it was four, but it's five letters. It's one of the major something. Uh, can you eat it? It is as the four seven being something about now near far wherever you are. Um, now the largest eight five. The largest something something in Asia. All right. Um, nothing is jumping out at me on this one. I think I may have made a terrible mistake to try and tack this one onto the end. Um, but they do not. Something to something. They do something there. Uh, let's try children, clothing, tool, um, transport, no, a wrap, present. I hope you all got lovely presents. Um, 
in something North, North Korean. Let's try China. China is usually involved. No, India. Ooh, 33 India. Ah. Well, let's try Indian as well. In Indian, not agriculture. One of the major, oh, is it something to do with religion? In the uh, Hindu, no. In the something religion. Is this uh, Northern India? Yes. Let's try first, second, third, fourth. Oh, uh, BCE. So this is very, uh, very old. Is it a building of some kind? A temple? Ooh, 16 temples. How about Buddhism? Buddhist? Just one of each. Wow. Something, something of 11 is blank. The evidence contradictory, maybe? No. Um, something and scarce? Uh, how about Judaism? No. Uh, Christianity? No. Okay. Uh, A.D., C.E., in the second millennium, no, ah, it's one of the major Hindu something along, yeah, I don't think I'm, if it's, I'm ashamed to admit I don't know much about Hinduism, um, is it a sect? It is a sect. No, I don't think I'm going to know this. I'm going to use some hints. Um, so yeah, let's try this 16 letter word. Oh, that's funny. It allowed me to click on the 16, but then it didn't display it. I wonder if it's because uh, it's um, in another character set or something. There may be a little bug there. So let's try this. Denominations. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'm going to know this, but let's see what one of the others is. Maybe get my brain moving. Shavism. No, I don't know this, so I'm going to have to give up two in the one video. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Uh, Vaishnavism. Yeah, I think, you know, I might have thought of Vishnu, but I wouldn't have thought of putting in an A in their I, and it was Sanskrit. That's why it, I think, wouldn't show me that hint, but it wouldn't really have helped me, so I'm not mad at all. All right, well, a very disappointing showing uh, for my last uh, video of the year, but uh, that's all right. We're just doing it for a bit of fun. Anyway, I wish uh, you and your families and friends all the best for the rest of the year and a very happy new year for 2024, when I hope to talk to you then. Thanks for watching and have a great day.